Hello and welcome to Novato's single family home sale market update for December. Let's start by discussing the inventory situation. As of December 2023, Novato has a remarkably low 0.8 month supply of inventory. This means that if no new homes were listed, it would take less than a month to exhaust all available properties. <clears throat> Excuse me. This scarcity of inventory has resulted in a highly competitive market for buyers, for those more desirable homes, emphasizing the need for swift action when a desirable property becomes available. Uh, however, homes that are either overpriced, not tastefully finished in a less desirable area, need a good bit of work or a combination of these factors are sitting and selling for under the list price. Over the last 12 months, we have witnessed a substantial decline of 43% in the month's supply of inventory. This obviously indicates a shrinking pool of available homes for sale. <clears throat> for sellers, this means that there is less competition in the market, increasing the chances of a successful sale, all things considered. But buyers are being much more discerning the higher interest rates and cost of homeowner's insurance being a reason for this. Uh, buyers being more tentative and there being fewer of them. Currently, we're observing an original list price to sold price percentage of 94%. This is a significantly down from November's 102%. This indicates that on average, homes are selling for under their listing price. Sellers and buyers should still be aware that of the 19 sales that occurred in December, 10 sold for over the list price, two at, and seven under the list price. Two of these sales were homes that sold for over the list price, were fixers where they each received 10 offers, and one selling for 87,500 over and the other selling for 120,000 over. Both of these closing in the low 800s. The other multiple offer sales, there were nine of them, generally just received two offers and sold for around 50,000 over on average. It is important to note that the time of year is also contributing to this ratio. For context, with this time of year being much more slower than other times with fewer buyers out. Another important metric to consider is the median days on market, which currently stands at 40 days in Novato. This means that on average, it takes 40 days for a property to go from listing to being sold. This figure demonstrates a slower market. Again, time of year coming into play. Also keep in mind those properties that are nicely done, properly marketed and priced are selling very quickly. And there were a number of properties that sold in just a couple weeks. However, three properties did take over 135 days to sell. Now let's talk about the median price in Novato. As of December, the median sold price was $1,165,000. This represents the middle price point where half of the homes sold for more and half sold for less. It's important to note that this figure can vary depending on the specific neighborhood and property type. Uh, this is down from the November figure of $1,375,000. Touching on the average price per square foot, it's at $562 a square foot. That's up by 1% year over year, but down by 13% from month over month. To wrap things up, Novato's real estate market is currently experiencing a low supply of inventory, leading to a heightened competition among buyers for those nicely done homes in good location or homes priced under the market price or a combination of these scenarios. We are also seeing buyers take advantage of the current longer days on market for some properties in negotiating price breaks and or sellers crediting to buy down the interest rate. Again, on those properties that have been sitting on with no offers. Sellers can take advantage of this of the scarcity in the market by maximizing their chances of selling above the listing price by doing some prep work, I, you know, paint, flooring, freshening up the front yard. Uh, with a median days on market of 40, 
It's crucial for both buyers and sellers to stay proactive and well-informed. Uh, thank you for watching and Happy New Year. I know this was a little bit longer. All the best.